firmware updates. Let's look at how to upgrade device firmware using EPC. Start by selecting the Launch Firmware Upgrade option from the main page. EPC will automatically scan for any IP gateways. When it is finished scanning, select the required IP gateways using the green checkboxes and then to the downstream Modbus address ranges to be scanned for device firmware discovery. Then, click on Show Firmware Details. If using USB, change the Find Devices via drop-down from IP to Serial and follow the device discovery process. You may need to look at which COM port is being used in your Windows device settings. When the status page appears, it will show the status of found devices, including the recommended actions. To update all devices, we can select the top checkbox showing the total number of devices to be upgraded. It will show an approximate time to complete this. It's also possible to select individual devices to see what upgrades are required. If there is an issue with the device, it will notify you and show you the recommended action to take. Choose the devices to update and click the Next button. Enter the device passcode and the device status should change to Ready to Upgrade. Click on the Upgrade button. A warning notice will pop up. If you're happy to proceed, click on the I Understand button to start the upgrade process. The process will advise the approximate length of time. If this is the first time Switchboards has been commissioned, it is recommended to do all of the recommended firmware updates for all devices. Be aware that this could take a long time, depending on the amount and types of devices in the project. When the process is completed, the status of any upgrades will be displayed. If we click on the return arrow, it will return us to the original update page block with an updated status. We can then either do further updates or when finished, we can exit the status window and go back to the main screen.